Meet the Su-57, Russia's ambitious answer to stealth fighters like the F-22 Raptor and F-35 Lightning. Developed by Sukhoi, the Su-57, NATO calls it the felon, represents the pinnacle of Russian aerospace technology. Combining stealth with supermaneuverability, the journey of the Su-57 began in the early 2000s with Sukhoi's Pak fa program, designed to replace aging Russian fighters and introduce a new era of air dominance. Despite budget challenges and delays, the Su-57 took its maiden flight in 2010 and continues to evolve. But Russia's push to bring this fighter to operational status underscores its importance to their air force. The Su-57 is equipped with features that set it apart. It's not just stealthy but also remarkably agile. Its design incorporates advanced avionics, low observable technology, and thrust vectoring engines, allowing it to perform extreme aerial maneuvers. Unlike Western stealth jets, the Su-57 doesn't prioritize radar invisibility alone. Instead, it combines stealth with survivability. While its stealth capabilities may not fully match the F-22, the Felon focuses on all aspects stealth with an innovative design, especially around its engine inlets and airframe structure. At the heart of the Su-57 is its twin-engine setup, capable of supercruise without afterburners, a trait reserved for true fifth-generation fighters. Each engine produces a thrust of around 17,000 pounds, giving the Felon a top speed of over Mach 2, with a range of approximately 2,200 miles, perfect for deep strike missions. The Su-57 is armed to the teeth. Its internal bays carry short and long-range air-to-air missiles, advanced air-to-surface missiles, and precision-guided bombs enabling the Felon to strike targets at significant distances while remaining concealed. Inside, the Su-57 is equipped with advanced avionics, featuring radar with a range of 250 miles, infrared tracking, and advanced data fusion capabilities. The cockpit is designed to provide a streamlined user interface, allowing pilots to process information quickly and make critical decisions in combat. Currently, Russia has several Su-57s in active service with plans to expand. While still relatively few, the Felon demonstrates Russia's commitment to advancing its air combat capabilities. Its success, however, depends on continued technological improvements and increased production. The Su-57 Felon may have started as an underdog, but its blend of speed, maneuverability, and firepower makes it a formidable presence in the skies. As the world watches, the Su-57 stands as a symbol of Russia's aviation ambitions, redefining what it means to be a fifth-generation fighter. If you enjoyed learning about the Su-57, don't forget to subscribe for more in-depth military aviation content. Thanks for watching.